Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and good days to our beloved lecturer Madam Marha and to everyone. My name is Natasha Alia Binti Hashim from class HM1114 FB representing all my group members from HM1114 FA and FB will present the business model canvas of our business which is O Butter Cookies. So today, as a representative, I will present about what we have done to make this business a success. The first one is our business key partners. Basically, we have two partners which is Lovely Bakery Supplier Kuantan and also CY Plastic and Packaging. These two partners are the one who supply the raw material for our business and the one who supply the packaging plastic for our product. Lovely Bakery Supplier in charge of supplying our raw materials such as flour, eggs, sugar and others while CY Plastic and Packaging will be supplying suitable types of plastic and packaging that we need to pack our product. So, these two partners are the important partners for our business. The next one is the key activities for our business. So, this is the activity that we will do to attract more customers and also to make our business is a well-known business. So, the first one is we create a website and social media development such as Instagram, WhatsApp and Facebook. Other than that, we also take a good care of our customer and partner relationship management. Next, order fulfillment and shipping for our customers. Not just that, we also do some marketing, promotions and advertising to attract customers to buy our product. We also take very seriously about the preparation of our product's production, product packaging, product pricing and lastly, the selling of our cookies to our customers. Moving on to the next one which is the key resources of our company business. So the key resources is something that we require for our company and also for our cookies productions. There are four separations that we make for the key resources in our business. The first one is product, utilities, assets and also human manpower. For product, we need the ingredients, recipes, utensils and also machine to produce our product. For utilities, we need internet computers, printer, tablet, stationery, and processing place for our company. Next, for assets, we have an oven, mixer, storage, and packaging. Last but not least is the human manpower, which is we need the chef for our cookies production. Alright, now I will present about the value propositions of our product. For our value propositions, our product provides various and delicious flavor that gives a lot of satisfaction to our customers. Next, our product serves suitable and high quality ingredients, which is we only use premium ingredients to bake our cookies. For our packaging product, we will make sure that our product is well and secure packaging. Furthermore, we will make sure that our products are all fresh baked. Moreover, our products is available for online purchase such as at Shopee platforms. To maintain our customers' relationship with us, we provide a free gift for our regular customers. We also provide a way for customers to order through online. Other than that, we also make interaction with our customers at the pickup point. Next, we will introduce a new product to attract our customers' interest. Furthermore, our business will follow the geographic expansion for our customers' satisfaction. For our business channel, Customer can find and purchase our product using emails and also phone order. They also can buy at retails. Lastly, we are giving business card and our shop pamphlet to our customers so that they can easily recognize about our business and easily contact us for any purchases. The last part for business model canvas of our business project, I'll be explaining about customer segment, cost structure and also revenue streams. So for our customer segments, we focus more on teenagers and also children. Why teenagers and children? This is because this group of age, they love to eat sweets and always crave for sweets. And teenagers and children, they always buy sweets for their snacks. And for the teenagers, they also buy something like cookies or other sweets to eat while studying. For our cost structure, there are three things that we focus on which is product, assets and also fix it. So what are those? So the first one is product. The product include the ingredients and also packaging. The next one is assets, which is the mixer, oven, and also the utensils. And the last one for the cost structure, which is fixed sets, that include company rentals and also fixed set company salary. 
Last but not least are the revenue streams of our business which is advertising and also sales. For advertising, we use our social media platforms such as Instagram and also WhatsApp. And also to increase our sales, we will recruit agents and also drop ships and we will also doing some promotions.